Hi there, it's Scooby, and I'm here with another quick and dirty tutorial. Stick around, and I'm going to show you all about using BandLab's AI splitting feature to get stems from your AI track. Okay, start. Once you have a track that you want to split, you will want to head over to BandLabs.com slash splitter. You can see it's up there. Or just BandLabs.com, and you can find it via their services. Now, once you have your track, you can either click on the button here and bring up a dialog box to open it, or you can just take your track and drag it right on top, like so. Now, if you are on a free tier like I am, you only get four tracks, vocals, drums, bass, and others. If you have their paid tier, you can actually have it try to split the guitar out as well. This is just fine. Usually the four tracks is, is probably good enough for most things that you're going to need. Um, just go to the split button and it's going to start the process. First thing you'll do is upload your song and from there it will then split it out. We'll speed time up here and I'll see once it's done splitting. And there you have it. So once it's done splitting, you will see the four tracks separated out. And of course, remember the quality of your audio putting into it is going to affect how well the AI is able to split things out. Uh, this particular track, if you hit play right now with all four tracks going, it's going to sound like the original track. And if we were to mute the vocals, you get the track without the vocals. You can solo and just hear the drums. Caps nice little beat there. Your guitar track. Should live on the others, although for a, most AI tracks, the guitar track is usually mixed in with this uh, other section, and parts of it live in these other areas. Again, it's going to depend on how clear the track is and that sort of thing. At this point, to get your split stems, you can either uh, hit the download all stems when you have nothing muted, or if you only wanted to say like your drum track, you can hit the solo, and it will only download just the drum track. In this case, we're going to download all four stems, so you click the button. Depending on your browser, you may have to allow it to do multiple downloads. But what we can see now is that we have the drums, other, and vocals, and it missed the bass, which happens sometimes with my Chrome uh, download extension. If that happens, you know which one you need. Just hit uh, solo on the bass, hit download stem. It'll download that as well, and now we have drums, other, vocals, and bass. You now have these separated out into their own stems, and you can use it into your own DAW for editing or anything else. You also, instead of downloading it, can hit open in studio, which will then pull all of the stems together into your BandLabs studio if you happen to use that. I actually sometimes use Cakewalk, so this is a little easier for me because I can pull it into here, save this project and then find it in Cakewalk under my other thing. But either way, this has been your quick and dirty tutorial on how to use BandLab's AI Splitter to split your track into individual stems. If you liked it, give me a subscribe, give me a like, and hop down to the bottom, comment, tell me what you would do with your separated stems, and we will see you again next time.